I would like to quickly point out that John the Mouse video has a large selection of videos from North and South America for your viewing pleasure. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Now let's get into the cheese of the matter. Good roads. Years before the white man came, the red man was breaking through tough trails through the forest. And when the pioneer who clums her conveyances demanded wider avenue traffic, in these days they traveled 10 to 15 miles a day. Transportation has wonderfully improved, but the highways are behind the times. In fact, many of them are in the same condition as when traveled by Pioneer in his ox cart. Bumbling along like a train without a track and covering the landscape with dust. The village smithy was once a busy man. Today, he realizes that his trade has gone to the while the garage man across the way is too busy to go to lunch. When we drove to church in the old Surrey, we had no hint of the automobile. Grandmother didn't object to the joy riding then, as grandfather would tell you with a wink. So how can she object to this? where the farm folk once had to be satisfied with the occasional entertainment at the schoolhouse. Now they can find real entertainment and instructions at the movies when the roads are good, thus making farm life more attractive. The mud road to the Little Red Schoolhouse is still with us. Our children of today should have clean, hard roads to travel on their way to school. Good roads make for a better homes and for better schools for happier and content children. The tragedy of a rural life, the woman imprisoned on the farm by bad roads, must be forever removed. The way must be open for a brighter, happier social life in the country. Farm lads once rode to the village for the weekly mail. Uncle Sam now carries the mail to the farm every day. And brings back produce 
direct to the city man's door. Economical forces are shifting traffic to the highway and today where the roads will permit. The Rural Motor Express handles farm freight. Once the farm wife had to wait till Sunday to market her eggs and butter. Cash comes into every house every day as the market shifts to the farmhouse gate where the roads are good. Do not think of the road as meaning merely the distance between two given points or cities. It is one of the arteries through which flows the lifeblood of the nation. John the Mouse Travel Map is available for Google Maps. It will help plan your route to the locations of your favorite videos. It is free to use. I have the link below. Please visit the playlist tab for videos that I have sorted for you. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button 